why pray if God is all-knowing? Why pray if God is all-knowing? Right? And, and the thing is this, this kind of reasoning, this kind of wrong thinking, wrong believing, will cause you not to pray because you say that God knows all my needs anyway. In Matthew 6, in the Sermon on the Mount, Jesus talked on prayer. Over here, he says, Therefore do not be like the Gentiles, people who do not know God. For your Father knows the things you have need of before you ask Him. So because of this reasoning, people say, Look, <laughs> my Father knows, God knows all my needs before I ask Him, so why pray? And yet the next verse says, In this manner therefore pray, because the Father knows your needs in this manner, therefore, he didn't say, in this manner, therefore, don't pray. On the contrary, he says, because your father knows your needs before you ask him, now ask. Amen. In other words, God says, I have all these blessings right now I'm about to bring into your life. Favor, wisdom, amen, uh, um, health, wholeness, amen. But I need something from your side. What is it? You must consent. You must agree for me to bless you. I cannot bless you beyond your free will. I cannot bless you beyond your violation. Do you want this blessing? Prayer is nothing more than an open heart, open mind, open life, open hands. Remember this, you bring nothing to God. We are all empty. God, the source, brings all His blessings and gifts into your life. Amen. So prayer is just an expression of, here is my open hand. God cannot bless someone, no matter how sincere the person is, if he has a close mind, close heart, close hands. And saying things like, if God want to bless me, God bless me. And that's why amen is an expression of, so be it. It's a prayer. It's a sh the shortest prayer I know, amen. Which means if you hear uh, the word of God being preached, and you say amen, God says, angel, that one wants. Amen. That lady wants it. All right, pour it on her. Another one say, Amen. All right, angel, this one wants it. Pour it on him. Amen. So the thing is that, do you want it? If you want it, you got to show God that you want it. Open mouth, open hands. That's prayer. The pastor, how long do I keep on praying? Keep on praying. Now, why, why keep on praying? Why keep on praying? Because there is an enemy. Like I said, if it's Garden of Eden and there's no enemy, there's no need to keep on praying. In fact, you hardly have to pray. You just think and, and, and God answers. But don't forget, if we're in a fallen world, we need to show God our open hands. And that comes by prayer. Even when Jesus was here as a man, He would rise up early in the morning and He would pray. If the Son of God prays, how much more you and I? The Bible says you have not because you ask not. Therefore you fight. Therefore you are jealous, you are envy, you lust, and you cannot have. James chapter 4. It says you lust, you covet because you cannot have. And then you, you assassinate people's character, you say bad things and all that because you are jealous of what they have. And then the Bible says you have not because you ask not. Amen. So when we have not, we start, you know, a, a good case in mind was David. The Bible tells us that David in that day and age, all right, that the king has a number of wives, okay? Yet he chose this one man's wife, committed adultery with her. You all know this, uh, the name of that girl, right? What's her name? Bathsheba. Saw her taking a bath, <laughs> all right? And committed adultery with her, had a son by her, and had her hu husband murdered. Then God sent a prophet to David, and the prophet says these words. You can check it out in your Bible. If God says, I took you from the sheepfold to shepherd my people Israel. I did this, I gave you, I bless you. And then God says, if that was not enough, I would have given you more. Did you hear that? Jesus says on the Sermon on the Mount, keep on asking, original Greek, keep on asking and you will receive. Keep on seeking and you will find. Keep on knocking, the door will open. The year of the open door. Asking starts with A. Seeking starts with S. Knocking starts with A, K. Ask.